welcome to another What I Eat In A Day video. I hope you enjoy today's video. If you do, please give it a like. And if you want to see more videos from me of this kind of nature, please subscribe to my channel and then you'll get alerts when I've uploaded more videos. Hope you have a lovely day and I hope you and your families are staying safe. Take care. So this morning I'm using my um, Tasmo machine. As usual, I'm going to have one of my skinny latte macchiatos, which are two and a half things. I get these from Amazon. Uh, I get like five packs for £16 something. I'll put the link below if you're interested in those, because they're quite a bargain price. So yeah. So this morning I'm having my overnight oats that I made on my last video which have been in the fridge um, overnight. It's got a grated apple, one molar light, which is half a sin, and um, it's got 40 grams of porridge oats, which is one healthy extra bee. So this is all mixed together now. I did put a splash of water last night, which makes the oats puff up a bit. So this should be really filling. So I'm having my second coffee of the day. This is an instant one. I've measured out about... 40 mils of lacto-free milk. This is all I've got left. So I've been kind of splitting my first healthy extra A between soy milk and um, lacto-free milk to kind of make the lacto-free milk last longer at the moment because um, I'm not able to get it every week and um, it, soy milk doesn't go very well in coffee, I find. So save my lacto-free milk for coffee and have my soy milk for any cereal or... Um, any teas that I have so yeah yesterday I didn't actually drink tea till so late in the day <laughs> I think it was just such a busy day um yeah and just a productive day I say so yeah so this is my coffee this morning I've used my milk frother I'll tag that below and I've put a bit of vanilla um syrup in there this is not a Jordan's one, um, this is a random one I got in TK Maxx a while ago. I'm waiting for my um, Jordan's one to arrive in the post now. So yeah, I'm going to have this coffee and my overnight oats now. So today for lunch I'm going to make this pasta and sauce, which is half a sim. And I'm going to put in some mixed veg and some bacon as well, two bacon medallions that I'll cook separately and chop on the top and um, I think I'm going to have a piece of garlic bread as well as a bit of a treat which is seven and a half sims with some cheese on that as well using a healthy extra a yeah I'm feeling utter exhausted today after looking after my son non-stop for the last few weeks Um, yeah I think I normally go into the office like a few days a month and that's my time to like have a bit of a break <laughs> And um, I think I'm really missing that now at the moment because it's just been a constant. And with decorating at the weekends and trying to keep him out of paint, I think now it's just hitting me that I'm just so tired. So I really wanted to just think, right, stuff it. Today I'm just going to like go off plan and have a frozen pizza and just pick up. I thought, no, that's not really the answer, emotional eating. So I thought, right, what can I have that's quick and easy? Because I, I forgot this morning to get out some bread to defrost for lunch. So I thought, right, I've got this in the cupboard. Let's go with this. And um, I really like these pasta and sauces. So hopefully this will still feel a bit of like an indulgence, especially with the garlic bread. So yeah, this is what I'm going to do. So I've put in 350 mils of water. That's what is suggested. It says you can add butter, but I've chosen not to on this occasion. So this is the mixed veg I'm going to mix in. I really love this one, actually. It's the first time I've tried it. Because it's got um, cauliflower and broccoli in it, and um, carrots, peas, etc. But I like that it's chopped really finely, so this would be really nice to mix in with even some um, rice. Um, because, yeah, it's really chopped really nice and finely, all the... Um, cauliflower and broccoli and I think it would be easy to even hide in some food if if your children are not that um, into cauliflower and broccoli because it's small pieces I think it's more um, easy then for them to accept so yeah this is what I'm going to mix in with my pasta 
I'm actually having second thoughts about the garlic bread now because I, I remember that these pasta and sauce pouches, this is the 99 grams one, these um, actually fluff up to being quite big so I don't think I'm actually going to have the garlic bread, I'll save my sins for a treat later. Um, yeah, but what I could do is actually put some of this um, reduced fat cheese on top and melt it. So I think that's what I'll do to get in my um, healthy extra A today. So that's my 40 grams of cheese. It's actually showing 38, but that will do for me. So I've just added in some more water. I always forget with these pasta sauces, always add in more later on um, of water than it actually says on the packet because I like my pasta to swell up quite a bit. Um, yeah, so I always add more than the packet. And just boil that off. My bacon medallions are done here. I'm just going to chop the fat off to make them free and slice them up. I've just chucked in some mixed herbs for a bit of extra flavour. So I've microwaved the veg and I've chucked that all in um, with the pasta. Now I've added even more water because it's still not um, puffed up enough for me. So, <laughs> yep, I'm continuing on with the boiling. I've chopped up my bacon and cheese ready to sprinkle on top. So, yeah, hopefully this will hurry up because I'm so hungry by now. Yeah, but I'm glad I've made this choice now, actually. And then... Um, for half a sim for all of this and um, yeah I think this is a good alternative so I'm glad I've got that in the cupboard. I think so it's I'm ending today on 13 and a half sims. We did go for a walk today um, which was probably about 5,000 to 6,000 steps just around our neighbourhood so yeah it's been a great day of food and really enjoyed it and I'm still really enjoying it and all the stoop so yeah. Yeah, so I hope you're all staying safe in. and your family's alive. I'm to actually Take care, get some everyone. more clothes on my next shop, for sure. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to tucking into this when it's ready. So this is my finished dish. I'm so looking forward to tucking into this. Yeah, I haven't bothered grating the cheese too much, but I know this will just melt into it and I'll swirl it in, so... Yeah, this is my quick lunch for today. So this is my dinner tonight. This it was on my previous video. So this is just a slow cooker. Kale, butternut, squash, sweet potato and lentil stew, which I added beef to. And I've got it with basmati boiled rice, which is free, and some spinach for speed. So, yeah. This is my food log for today. I did forget to put the half a sin on the list of sins for the pasta and sauce, so I'm actually ending the day on 15 and a half sins. Um, on my food log you can see other snacks which I may not have had a chance to record today, and how I've used my healthy extra A's and B's. So yeah, it's been a wonderful day of food, really enjoyed it. Stay safe everyone!